Uh, it's getting colder. Summer is short. Remember how I talked about adventure in my last video? What if I told you there was an RPG sandbox adventure with a charming world and a pixelated style? Terraria! Wait, hold on. Terraria is better than Minecraft. Here is why. Terraria is an actual meat on the game. There is several bosses in the vanilla game and like a thousand different weapons including the four classes and one subclass which is entirely garbage. Terraria is mostly a sandbox adventure so you kind of make your own story. There is a set path for you to progress but you choose how. Same with Skyrim. The main difference being that the starring character and the end character they difference is way bigger in Terraria than in Skyrim. See Send Point? Yeah, I stole the clip because that sort takes ages to make. Like, look at the recipe. Screw that! With the progress mechanic and rush of how bosses slowly turn into a bullet hell, you somehow still survive? You would say it's hard to put the game down, but the game is not addicting. addicting. Shut up, Foco! <laughs> The game has its downtime, that does not sound addicting. Repeating blood moons, especially solar eclipses, they are annoying. Barely serve a purpose after you already have all the loot. So you're left to AFK farm the event while you make a sandwich in the other room. Yeah, you can farm mobs in Terraria. What about it? Summoner pest class. <laughs> In all honesty, the reason I wanted to talk about Terraria is because of the game's price. Now think for a second, hundreds of hours of gameplay, replayable systems, thousands of items, how much would it be? Like 50 bucks, right? Eh, no, it's 10, it's 10 bucks, that's fucking cheap. Really. Best thing is that you can get Tmod which is now on Steam so you have no excuse not to get it and download mods for Terraria. Start off with Calamity mod and work up from there. It's not the biggest or craziest but it is pretty cool and will give you a new challenge. Fuck I don't know, it's cheap, 9 out of 10. But